The discussion between Rick and Mac and stem cell transplant is a very historical one. It's a very controversial and very emotional one for, transpla for transplanters. What now becomes more obvious is that the response before transplant matters. So we now have the capability of doing measurable residual disease evaluation. And recent studies found that there seems to be a difference between re reduced intensity conditioning and myelodative conditioning when we take into account measurable residual disease positivity. Their re uh, reduced intensity conditioning is obviously not uh, better than my myeloblative conditioning. For MRD negative patients, this is completely open space. And what we don't have so far is a randomized prospective study. We only have uh, retrospective studies. So I would say it's for this setting, it's a really individual patient selection with consideration of comorbidities, age, but also patient preferences, but and also experience of the center. So what we need for MRD negative patients is a prospective study.